It's a big week for girls wrestlers and boys swimmers as they head to their respective state meets. Girls wrestlers are headed to Bloomington. The IHSA hosting its second ever state championships for girls wrestling, a sport that is exploding around the state. In fact, it's become the fastest growing high school sport in the state of Illinois. This sport has finally, it's getting bigger and just it's so fun making history. Like, I'll go down in school's history and hopefully the state history. It's just amazing seeing it blow up. We have over a thousand more girls than we did last year, and seeing girls finally fighting is amazing to me. And this year we had a lot more girls on the team, so it was really a new, like, form of encouragement to, you know, be involved with a team of girls and seeing them come here and compete for the first time, and then we're all cheering each other on. I think that a lot of girls would be feel more comfortable coming out for it. I mean, they all treat me like one of their own. We're all really close in family, so I think that um, more girls should give it a try. Alex is Washington's first ever girls wrestling state qualifier. Grossinger Motors Arena hosts the state wrestling tournament starting on Friday. Boys swimmers headed north to suburban Westmont for this weekend's state meet, and some area swimmers will make their state debuts this weekend. They know what to expect, a loud, energetic final meet of the year. Last year I did the 200 and the 100 breast, and 200 I was about a half second off. So this year I'm glad I could finally come to sectionals and I can just prove myself and prove that, yes, I have the material to go to state. It feels really special. I want to make sure my team, uh, everyone that's going with me, uh, is doing the best that they can, and I hope uh, that we can all uh, finish as high as, as well as we can. I'm excited. I have a few expectations. I attended last year for a school relay, so I kind of know going in, but not this race at all. Um, I'm definitely excited. Good luck to our area swimmers and divers headed to the boys' state finals.